Hello everyone, this is uh, me again trying myself at the noble art of the unboxing video. Um, I did a previous unboxing video for the first box set in which I was talking and I did again a second video for a second box set last year and I didn't talk at all because um, to be honest, I didn't like at all my English accent in the first video, but now in 2017 there is a third box set and I'm trying to speak to you again. I hope you don't mind my um, horrible accent. Okay, here we go. This is a new carrier in a new town from 77 to 82. And we have this record and book. Let's go right away with the first album in the box set. Low. Here it is. You can see right away that on the back um, there is a sticker with the titles, just like the original. Titles are not printed on the album. I brought here an original. This is a UK pressing from uh, 1977 with a sticker. Can you see the sticker here? Okay. And uh, you can see that, you know, they're very, very similar. Of course, there's a Parlophone logo instead of the RCA, but apart from that, it's very, very similar. And inside, just like the original album, you have an insert with the credits for the songs and then the record itself there you go very beautifully made I must say and you also have an insert which was in the original I don't have it in my own copy but this is a, an official information for the David Bowie fan club. It's a nice touch to having to have put this into the new version of Low. Next album in the box is Heroes. Contrary to Low, this album is laminated. It's a glossy cover. There you go. And once again the insert with the lyrics, the record, and you also have an insert for the fan club, but it's a different one this time. Very nice. The next piece in the box is a special thing. It's called a Heroes EP, it's actually a 12-inch single which includes four different versions of the song. You have Heroes Helden and then Helden, which is the German version. Heroes Helden is actually the song with the first half sung in English and the second half sung in German. And this version was actually the only version of a song in the German LP of Heroes. And Helden is the single German version. And on the B side you have the same thing exactly, but this time it's uh, English and French. So it is Heroes Hero. Once again, Heroes Hero was on the French LP and Hero was a French single. I think it's a nice touch to having put all this in one single disc, you know, instead of putting them on uh, the record compilation. Because, you know, if you want to listen to four versions of Heroes, you can. And if you want to listen to a more um, more variety of uh, non-album tracks, you get the record compilation. This is nice, and actually, you can see that the label is a less bright orange. It's almost um, light brown. Um, the German original single was like that, the same color. Next, you have a live album. Stage, okay. 
uh, special limited edition on yellow vinyl. This is not a gimmick for the new box set. The original UK version of stage was on yellow vinyl, so they reproduced it here, and it's a, also a nice touch. Uh, this packaging, I, I've always wondered why they put a gatefold cover for stage because you have a David Bowie picture, the same David Bowie picture, the same David Bowie picture. <laughs> I mean, a simple non gatefold sleeve would have sufficed, right? There weren't any inner sleeve on the original, so it's all white. And there you have the LP in all its shiny yellow translucent glory, yay! <laughs> okay, so this is stage. Next we have stage 2007 edition, okay? It's an extended and modified version of the album. The songs are now in the concert order. Uh, it's a free LP album and um, there are additional songs. The artwork is now more elaborated. You still have uh, the yellow RCA label, but this time it's on black vinyl. And you have, for the three discs, some inner sleeves. Here's the first one. Okay. David Bowie and some information. Here's the second one. It's always difficult to put this record out. Here's the second one. And the third one here. All right. Okay, coming up next, the Lodger album, here, with this strange cover, laminated and very glossy, alright, and once again the usual insert with lyrics. And the album itself. Another curious thing is a new version of Loja with an inverted cover and this new version contains a Tony Visconti new remix of the album. The inner sleeve has been remixed again also if you can see and there you have the record in yellow, uh, orange, yellow, orange. <laughs> There the last album, but not least, Scary Monsters and Super Creeps. Everything here is just like the original UK LP. I like this very much in this collection. This is black RCA-like label, just like on the original. And you have the insert, which is a double page insert with lyrics, a bit of photographs and Nothing, just like on the original. A major important thing, the recall compilation, two LPs of non-album tracks. This time it's really interesting. You have only a few single edits, but you have a lot of non-album songs. And I must say that the people in charge of this box set have done a very, very, very uh, exhaustive job because I think everything is in here. You got. Uh, extended version of Beauty and the Beast, which was on, on the 12. Uh, you get the Australian version of Breaking Glass as a single, which is longer than the album version. You have Alabama Song and Space Oddity 79, which were a standalone uh, 45 in the UK. And you have Crystal Japan. You have Under Pressure, the song with David Bowie, uh, with David Bowie, with Queen. You have Cat People. Uh, the long version, which he was on the soundtrack album of the movie. You have Peace on Earth, Little Drummer Boy with Big Crosby, which was a standalone single. And then on all of side four is Bertolt Brecht's Ball, all the five songs that were released on a seven inch in the UK, 12 inch elsewhere at the time. And there you have the inner sleeves for the two recall records. And if you wanna wonder what the label looks like, here it is, 
mighty green. Okay. And as I said earlier, the book. Once again, it's a very, very good piece of work. Just like the box set itself, it's not a shiny, glossy cover. Uh, this time it's all matte. Uh, the two previous boxes and books were glossy. This time it's matte, I don't know why. Sometimes I feel the need to move on. A quote from the song Move On. And you have information about the albums, pictures, memorabilia. Um, timepieces, you know, articles from the enemy or a melody maker. And it's really, really lovely, very nice quality. Uh, this is the Heroes EP, newly created for this box set, and you have the original covers of the German version and the French version. Many pictures, many texts. This is the stage album. Lodger. I like this. Scary Monsters. I love um, Ashes to Ashes character, the clown. Here he is. And you have then all the detailed content of the recall compilation with infos about each and every track included with the original artwork and now that we're entering we're almost uh, in the 80s and now in the UK 45s have most of the time cover sleeves and it's very nice to have them here and this is the Baal original 7 inch. And there you go, and there's, there's a, as usual a hint at the end of the book, a hint concerning the forthcoming box set. This time there's a brand new dance, but I don't know its name. And it's of course a nod to a Let's Dance album, and it's a quote from the song Fashion. There you go, the new box set. I hope you enjoy this video. And I probably will see you again in a year for the forthcoming box set. Bye-bye.